Hello, my name is Mark Plunkett and today in this tutorial I'm going to be talking a little bit about how to create a slideshow using the object states panel and the overlay creator in InDesign and view it inside the iPad. Alright, so I have an example over here already so I'm going to just delete this so that I'm going to show you all over again how it is done. Alright, so I'm going to be placing all the images that I want it to be into the slideshow by going to file place I'm going to be selecting all the images that are called underscore OS which is of course the larger image there are a total of 7 images I need to select open I'm going to be placing all the 7 images randomly, it doesn't really matter where it is I'm going to select all 7 images align them I'm going to move them and align to the other contents of the page alright, looks good now, once we're done doing the alignment for the images we're going to be going to the object states panel create a new object state and over here you'll be able to see all the seven states are inside here so you're going to change the alignment of which image will project first and which will be later you can just move it like the layers panel so you can just click and drag you can move the alignment when it will appear when it will not appear okay which one comes first which one goes last okay so based on what I have the thumbnails over here, I'll probably follow it very closely. Seven goes up. Six. Then five. And four. Three. Two. And one. Great. Now once we're done with this, you need to deselect it select it one more time as a whole alright you'll be able to see now we are done with the object states panel now we need to go back to the overlay creator then the slideshow category here or section here will appear automatically if you have it selected alright so if you look at it here closely I can create something like an autoplay like it's like an automated slideshow or you can tap to play or tap to pause fading will be from slide to slide okay, I'll be activating the crossfade and the swipe to change image okay. I don't need it to stop at the first and last I'll just let it look the rest of the settings are not required so once we are done all you need to do is now preview inside the Adobe Content Viewer for your desktop by going to file folio preview alright, I already have it activated so I'm going to show you on my screen which is here as you can see I can actually slide click, drag, slide, slide so on your iPad you'll be using your finger to just tap and then just swipe it okay, as you can see there is a fade of 0 0.5 seconds Right. So if you want to activate these buttons to trigger a particular slide or a state I will bring you back to InDesign again and All you need to do is just select the particular image that you have placed in here Go to the buttons panel Activate on event on release On the actions here, target go to state okay. and select the particular state that you want. Oh, this is the other state, I'll be selecting multi state 3, and I will select let's say this image belongs to state 7. That's all you need to do, all right? 
create the buttons, select the state you want to target to, and then it will work inside the iPad.